Lauren Messiah, your personal fashion stylist, and it's time for a fashion question. Hooray! Today's question is a good one. And the question is, Lauren, how much do personal stylists cost? That's an excellent, excellent question. For anyone who's shopping around for a personal stylist, it's really important to know what kind of investment you're getting yourself into. Working with a personal stylist is absolutely an investment, especially if you wanna work with a good one. Now, I think there's maybe a couple misconceptions about personal stylists and the work that we do. At first, it was like, well, I have to be super rich or famous if I were ever to consider having my own stylist. And then personal styling became a lot more mainstream. There's you know websites like Keaton Row and Stitch Fix and all these style in a box types of services. And because of the work I do at School of Style, I'm cranking out personal stylists like they're cotton candy. So everyday people know that they can have access to their own stylist, which is wonderful. Everyone should have a stylist. I want to live in, the, in a world where just like you have you know, a personal trainer or a manicurist or a hairstylist, you've got a personal fashion stylist too. So the access level is great. However, a lot of people don't understand that the work we do is not like working at the mall, okay? We're not these like, you know, retail workers. Nothing wrong with retail. I worked retail plenty of years, but the work we do is much deeper than just picking out some clothes for you at the store. There's a ton of hours that are put into this job from consulting with the client, from developing their style, which is the most important part is to really get on the same page of what your new you know, visual representation is going to look like. Developing, shopping, putting together the outfits, conducting the fitting, doing the returns, hiring support staff, closing out all the billing, like it's a job. <laughs> you can go and see some of my past client makeover videos to see the interaction with the client. And I also have some behind the scenes videos that I shoot myself on my iPhone where you can see the actual work that goes into the job. So the point being is it's not cheap, okay? Most personal stylists, I would say beginner personal stylist, they don't have a lot of experience, they don't have a lot of clients under their belt. They make probably around between 50 and 75 bucks an hour. Now if you're working with the big dogs, you know, bigger personal stylists, ones that have been around, have respect in the industry, a lot of clients. We make, you know, 350 an hour, 400 an hour and upwards. So know that going in that it can be a little pricey to work with this personal stylist. I would say if you were thinking about working with a personal stylist and you wanted to like play it safe and not spend a lot on your wardrobe, a good solid investment would be around five to seven thousand dollars. So if you don't have five to seven thousand dollars to throw around, it might not be the time for you to hire a personal stylist. Now, I developed some virtual options for women who want to work with a personal stylist, but they don't quite have five to seven thousand dollars to invest in the whole experience. So my virtual rates start at 197 and you know my most popular package it's around 500 bucks there's some other you know bells and whistles you could add but that helps you develop your style and it's a very affordable way to start working with a personal stylist then you can slowly start buying wardrobe on your own in those packages i recommend pieces for you with links, you can purchase them online. But this allows you to have a stylist to develop your style, kind of get your feet wet before you've got, you know, thousands of dollars to drop into this. So, really great question. I thought it would be helpful to answer it here on video to give you some context of 
what a stylist might cost. Because we never put prices on our websites, I certainly don't, except for the virtual products, you can just add them to cart. And I think people get a sticker shock when they email stylists and ask for their rates. That's because it's a tough job, okay? It takes hours and hours, support staff that needs to be paid. So that's what's going into your investment along with your wardrobe as well. So I hope that answers your question. If you have a fashion question for me, you can absolutely ask it. Drop it in the comment section below this video. While you're down there, I have tons of freebies that you can download. So check out and see what selection is available right now. And be sure to subscribe to my channel because I'm doing cool videos like this all the time. Don't want you to miss a single one. So get your subscribe on and I'll catch you in the next video.